Hi everyone, it's Erin. Welcome back to my channel. Um, today we're doing something super fun. I'm doing a holiday gift guide and I swear to you that these gifts are not your average gifts. <laughs> Every time I see a holiday gift guide, like, they're good and all and they give me inspiration, but, like, stuff that, like, I'm like, okay, yeah, get a book, okay, get this. No, like, these are legit. You're going to love my suggestions for gifts, and not only am I going to do things that I've been gifted in the past or things that I have in my personal life that I love, but I'm also going to be sharing what I'm asking for this year because I had a really, really hard time this year deciding what I wanted to ask for, so we're going to do that, and I'm going to show you a few things in my kitchen, um, but yeah, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe because I am coming out with videos at a rapid pace right now, and I just love it, so thank you all for the support so far. It has been so much fun, and I just spit everywhere. <laughs> All right, so first gift was actually my camera stand. Like I was using it as my tripod, which I have a tripod, so I don't know why I don't excuse that. But first gift, basic one, Bath & Body Works candles, best candles ever, smells so good. They now make them with essential oils instead of like weird fragrances. So if you are like clean beauty or beauty, if you are like clean into like scents in your home and you don't want any like weird chemicals. I mean, I'm not saying that there's no weird chemicals, but they are made with essential oils. Yeah, I'm reading it right here. Essential oils. So I, I stockpile these. They go on sale a lot. Um, Bath and Better Works always has coupons. So this one here is Sweater Weather. That is my all-time favorite scent. I'm going to prompt this back up to use as my prop. Um, Sweater Weather is the best smelling candle that they have. And then I also have this one. So I told you guys, seriously talk about them. They're not used yet. Um, this one's Harvest Gathering smells so good and the best part about they're three wicks so they literally smell up the entire room and my apartment's very small so they smell up the entire apartment and like Tom will walk in after work and be like oh my god it smells so good in here what'd you make I'm like nothing it's just a candle so get those love them everyone loves them boys love them girls love them like I used to buy them for Tom and his roommates they loved them right now I am obsessed with stasher bags this is actually something that I asked for as well as I have so these are reusable Ziploc bags. They're not really Ziploc, but they are perfect for everything. Like we store all of our like cut up tomatoes, all of our fruit, anything that goes in the fridge. They also, I'm pretty sure you can put them in the dishwasher. So they like, wash out. These are like my running gels right now, but I put everything in here because I hate using Ziploc bags. So stash your bags. Okay, next up is cookbooks. These are two of my favorite cookbooks. This is Everyday Dory and this is The Dude Diet. And I like them for different reasons. Um, I'll share with you first. So Everyday Dory, Tom's mom actually got for me. But I love this one because it's not necessarily like a healthier cookbook. But it's just like simple, easy to do meals for someone who doesn't want to do things that are complicated. Because I own a cookbook right now. I'm not going to say who it is. But every single meal in there is literally like, you need like 25 ingredients. And I'm like, okay, well, first of all, I don't have any of these. And by the time I go to the store and buy this, this is a $100 dish. So I am like basic. I love basic cooking, basic recipes, basic everything. So the Everyday Dory has like so many good recipes. Like they have a shrimp tacos in here that I make all the time. So delicious and simple. So I highly recommend it. You can get it online. I'll link it below. Um, but you can also get it at Barnes and Nobles. And then my other favorite one is the Dude Diet, which is I am obsessed with this. This is by Serena Wolf. Um, it's basically like junk food healthified and we love it like it's not even like crazy healthified it's just like nachos made healthier um they have like different skillets like like quinoa bakes in here that are just absolutely delicious um and we we seriously have been loving cooking from this she does like all different like she does like sweet stuff but she basically makes it like chipotle healthy or taco bell healthy or just different meals that you wouldn't think and then if you have a boyfriend that doesn't really cook or you want to get into cooking this would be perfect for them also brothers dads honestly there's so many different recipes in here forget how many there actually are but she says cleanish food for people who like to eat dirty it's a good one all right going into my next theme which is more for girls women um it's definitely girlier but so one thing that i'm having a hard time transitioning over to like clean beauty i do a lot of clean beauty products everything i'm wearing today is clean beauty um is my perfume so I'm going to share a few of my favorite perfumes ever. These are ones that like I think I smell like them. So like if I smell them out, I'm like, like if someone else is wearing it, I'm like, wait, <laughs> that smells like me. Um, it's Victor and Rolf Flower Bomb. This is my all-time favorite scent. I live for this scent. And then also Marc Jacobs Daisy is like one of my favorites too. So these are two scents that you cannot go wrong with. People will love them. I've been wearing these two both for years. I switch on and off, not together. I don't wear them together, but I love both of them. All right, next up is the Coco Kind Highlighters. You guys, I don't know if you can see this. 
is it, is it going? Is it focusing? These are the best. They actually ordered the entire package um, for Black Friday, but it has like the matcha stick in it, which can be used as like a lip balm. But the highlighters are amazing. I'm actually using it right now. You can see it on my cheeks a little bit. Put a little bit on my chin. I put a little bit on my nose, and it just adds a little bit of color, a little bit of shimmer, and I am obsessed with them. They have like all different um, shades too. So this is the rose one. They have a darker one, a bronze one. So if you're more tan, um, and then they also have this. Which color is this? This is the Reishi Gold, so it's more goldy. But I love the rose one because I love rose gold. Anything. These are amazing. They are amazing. They make your skin glow. It's all and also this is good for the clean beauty trend. They are all made with good ingredients. So the ingredients are like. Um, like coconut oil let's see if they say like coconut oil different like seed butters and stuff so highly recommend these highlighters from coco kind all right and then next up we have hair things scrunchies my friend amy um it's by ames she started a scrunchie company if you want to order one of her scrunchies i love them i love to even just wear them on my wrist like as i'm going out they're cute and they're fun to have like i hate when my hair is in my face so like anytime i'm eating and i'm out i like, always put my hair up like this okay not like that <laughs> i put my hair up like like a low ponytail but like having a scrunchie helps so much and i love these scrunchies this is the velvet one love it and then also i have i bought a pack of these bows which i literally love so some of them are longer so i like i'll wear them if my hair's in a ponytail uh but then they have let's see if i can find a short one for you because i like i keep the short ones here's a short one this is like a patterned one um but it just says like a cute little bow so if you like wear your hair, I'll put it under you. <laughs> you wear your hair, cute little hair scarf. I love them, they're super cute, super fun. So I got these um, from Amazon and honestly I was just like searching hair bows and this is what came up, so. Love, love, love those hair bows. I wear, literally wear one at least like one or two times a week. Okay, and then also on the topic of makeup, I got new makeup brushes. I have not yet opened them, but I bought these on Black Friday as well. Makeup brushes, no one ever thinks to buy themselves makeup brushes and then they realize, okay, I don't have anything to apply my foundation with or my blush with, and they're using their finger. I know that from experience because I was literally applying everything with my finger. So makeup brushes, that's always a good one that people do not think about. And then my new makeup bag. So this is an MZ Wallace bag. It is my favorite makeup bag ever. It's massive. It literally fits all of my stuff. I know it's a little bit pricier, but their stuff lasts forever and plus it's adorable. So a lot of the times like when we have like a Pollyanna or like a gift exchange for someone, like we want to buy them like a nice purse or something, but I don't know about you, I cannot afford like a $200 purse for like a friend gift. So this is like a perfect friend gift because it's like a, something fancier, a little bit nicer and you want to buy them something a little bit nice, but it's not nearly as expensive as like a full purse. I forget how much this one is. Um, I want to say like 60 or 70. No, no, it's not more than 60. Maybe it's like 50. I don't know. Um, but I bought this for myself and I love it. I will link it below as well. All right. I'm not doing too many clothes because... I feel like I share enough of my clothes, but if there's one thing I'm gonna share, it is my Barefoot Dreams cardigan. Seriously, the best piece of clothing that I own. It is incredible, it's so soft. It's honestly, I'll put it on and I feel like I'm wearing a blanket. They also have, they have cardigans, they have blankets, they have um, robes, they have like, I think they have like pants and shirts now too. If you buy anything from Barefoot Dreams, you will be super happy. It is the softest. Like, I've never felt something so soft. I'm not being dramatic. Like, I don't know how to make, like, can you tell? It's like fuzzy heaven, and it's like so soft. They're expensive, but definitely worth it. I've had this one for a year, and if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I literally wear it every single day. Like, I want to put it on right now. So, Barefoot Dreams cardigan, best thing ever. All right, so next on my list. Party time, party time, party time. So this is a decanter. We use this for wine. It's a little bit dusty right now because we haven't used it in like a month. Um, but you pour your red wine in here. It's perfect for people for bleh, 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 bleh. it's perfect for people who like to host. Um, pour your wine in here, let it decant, serve it for a party. Next up, I got Tom. Let's see if this focuses. I got Tom this um, whiskey glass with his initials on it. He loved it, and it's so fun. Like he'll drink, he'll sip, he'll sip like whiskey. I also got him like one of those big. Sorry, I have more glasses. Okay. Okay. Um, he'll, he'll like, I got him one of those, 
ice cubes. That is like a whiskey ice cube. So he will put the whiskey ice cube in here and then sip on some whiskey. Such a great idea. And then last but not least, my mom got me these Moscow Mule mugs because I love a Moscow Mule. And these are perfect. You have to have the mugs in order to have a good Moscow Mule because that is what makes it. It makes it super cold. The copper literally makes them freezing cold. And I love it. So Moscow Mule mugs as well. And then in addition, I forgot one more thing. I got this pineapple shaker, which how cute is it? it makes our bar cart look so fun. So this is another really good gift, a pineapple shaker. One of my favorite games to play ever, What Do You Mean? It is hilarious. It is so much fun. If you're drinking, if you're not drinking, just saying it's really fun with a couple glasses of wine. Um, such a fun game to play with friends. I've taken it to girls' nights. I've taken it to Tom and I will play together sometimes. I mean, it's really hard. I don't think you can play with that. You can actually play with two people. I don't know. Wait. No, you need three players. But I don't know. We'll look at the cards and like just crack up because they're so funny um but also if you like you can you can play this one with your parents i think it's g-rated or pg maybe it's pg 17 and plus 17 plus so i would say it's like pg pg 13 um but it's really really funny and it is just like such a good game it makes everyone laugh people come you can get anyone to come together and play this game so what do you mean is such a fun one Another gift that I love is a gift card to a workout studio. That is one of my favorite things because I obviously, like if you follow me on Instagram stories, you know that I like to work out doing workout classes. That's just like my jam. Um, and even if someone doesn't like to work out doing workout classes, this is something that will kind of like push them maybe into going to a workout class and maybe they'll change their opinion on it. So I actually recently got a gift card to Rumble, which is like a boxing studio here in Philly. They have them in, I think they have them in like a couple other cities like New York, um, Boston, but I was given a gift card for it and it is amazing because it's one free class. You can get like a certain dollar amount, um, a couple different classes onto a gift card, but like each class is like 30 bucks. So this saves me so much. So if you say you get your friend like a $50 gift card, they can get like probably two classes out of um, your gift card. So I feel like that's super worth it. Okay, another gift that is perfect is this Calf, not Calphalon, whoa, Calpac um, suitcase, which is, I know it's on my bed, that's a little bit gross, but it's kind of like an away suitcase, but it's half the price of an away suitcase. I have traveled with this for like two years now, and it is amazing. It also has a lock. It's great. It's way cheaper than an away, and if you can't afford that, then get this Calpac. Um, you can get it online. I think I actually have them at Target, too. Okay, also Instant Pot, one of the best gifts ever. Such an amazing one for people who like to be in the kitchen, even people who don't because it makes things super easy. Um, also, I love my Lodge. It's like a not like a knockoff of La Creuset, but it works just as well as La Creuset. It's a big um, Dutch oven. Is this a Dutch oven? Yeah. Love it. Instant Pot and then air fryer. Amazing gifts to give. Love them both. We use them almost every day. All right, so I'm also going to share what I'm asking for, and I have to pull up my email to my mom because I literally <laughs> cannot remember what I asked for. I remember like two things, but I'm going to tell you um, exactly what I asked for. They're kind of like basic, and as I said, like it's just I don't really need a ton of stuff, but it's like I mean, my mom's like, no, I want to wrap gifts for you, and I want you to have stuff under the tree. So that's that. So. I am going to tell you what I what I asked for, um, but if you have any more suggestions, please let me know because it's not too late. I mean, I can always like add on or just like my birthday's in January, so if I don't get something for Christmas, I can always ask for it in January. So, um, first things first, I asked for a Quip toothbrush. I've heard amazing things about them and I grew up using an electric toothbrush and then I stopped and my dentist is always like, you need to use um, an electric toothbrush, like it would really, really, be really good for you and I never really did. So I've heard amazing things about Quip and I know that you can just like, charge it right in your thing, like right in the little slot. So Quip toothbrush is on my list. Also on my list are AirPods. I don't really have like a good set of wireless headphones. So I was like, you know what? Maybe I should just ask for AirPods. And like, I keep seeing and hearing that everyone's obsessed with them. And I already know for a fact, 150% that I will lose them. So I don't think I'm gonna get like the newest rendition or whatever, like the noise canceling ones. Also kind of freaks me out that they're noise canceling because I like don't wanna be walking the streets of the city and not hear anything that's going on around me, but I don't know. So I asked for AirPods, but I wasn't like gung-ho <coughs> gung about them. So if I don't get them, I won't be like heartbroken. But I don't know, I'm just like totally joining the, the bandwagon on that one. Like I'm really totally joining the bandwagon. Like I don't have any really excuse. Like I always just use the wire and it's fine. Um, I asked for a weighted blanket. 
I really have, oh my god, you guys, everything I want is like because other people say that they're good. Is that how li this life works? Like, everyone talks about the weighted blankets and I think that it would be really good for me. Um, I sometimes just like love that feeling of like being all tight and hugged. And I just like really, really want to just have one of those to sleep with. And also like, if you don't know, I suffer from a little bit of anxiety. So I've heard that they're really good for anxiety as well. So I asked for a weighted blanket. Um, I also asked for a new wallet holder. So like I have this one right now, it's a little Kate Spade. I basically asked for another version of a Kate Spade one. It's just a like cute, it holds all my credit cards and my money and it's just tiny. And that's what I like to carry around. Like I don't, I'm not a huge purse girl. Um, but once in a while I'll have a purse. But, like I love the little card holders. So I'll link the one that I asked for. Um, I told you this, but I asked for more stasher bags. I want to get like big gallon size ones so we can put like lots and lots of stuff in there. So like if we're storing something that I need a lot of room for, it's not just like a little Ziploc bag. I asked for tickets to a musical or like some sort of show of some sort because I think that's such a fun date night. Um, and if I don't get that, I think I might get that for Tom. And I know he says he watches these videos, but like he's not paying attention. So I already know he's not, he's not going to hear this. Um, so I'm thinking about getting like some sort of musical or um, show tickets for him for Christmas and like making like a whole date night out of it. Like also doing something else that he really likes or a place that he really wants to go to um, for dinner and drinks. I also asked for a cooking class. So there's this place in Philadelphia called Cook and they do like these like cooking classes. It's a very small intimate room. There's probably like 10 to 12 people in there and you basically cook like a few course meal um it's pretty expensive but i've been wanting to do that for a while and that's a really fun idea we also one year tom and i gave my parents and then his parents which they live in separate places but we both gave them a um cooking class at sur la table sur la table and they both loved it and tom and i had both also done a cooking class there amazing such a great idea it's affordable i think it was like 80 bucks a per no not a person <clears throat> Maybe it was like 80 bucks total. Maybe it is 80 bucks a person, but you got like three course meal. You learn how to cook. It's really, really, really fun. So we really, they really enjoyed it. We did it. We enjoyed it when we did it and highly, highly recommend. All right. So I also asked for a hydro flask with the mouthpiece. That's like a straw. So you can basically, you don't have to like tilt your head up every single time you want water. We can just like put it up and drink out of that. Um, I have a healthy human water bottle right now and I like it, but I don't like the fact that I have to like chug and it like comes out like really slow. I don't know. I'm just not into it. So I want a hydro flask. Um, I like the white one or I don't know. I maybe have, I might have said teal. I don't even know. But I sent that over to my mom. So hydro flask as well. Um, perfect for working out or for anyone in general. People just, I need, just gets me like more, I'm more apt to drink water if I have one of those things around. And otherwise I'm like, okay, did I have one sip of water today? No, probably not. So. That's everything I'm asking for on my personal list and also my, as I said, my birthday's in January. So sometimes if I don't get something for Christmas, I'll just ask for it again in my birthday. So that's it. But anyway, thank you guys. I love you guys. You're the best. And please give me all the feedback.